Hey guys, it's KJ48, and welcome back to my Space Engineers Let's Play. This is Season 1, Episode 17, and I'm just sitting here in my command console in the Castiel Space Station, just uh, chilling like a villain. I uh, actually put five, um, five units of uh, uranium in the, in the uh, reactor, and that's only going to give me three hours of fuel time. So I think our next project is going to be solar panels. Now, I have a couple projects I want to do in this, on this uh, space station to kind of enhance what it does already. Um, number one is definitely solar panels because, like I said, I, like you can see when I was sitting in the chair, three hours uh, of fuel time for five, five units of fuel is not, it's not great. Um, so I'm thinking solar panels could really help with that. Now, I also want to put guns around this place. Uh, and then once I've gotten this place situated with uh, some kind of guns, I'm going to turn on asteroids. Now, here's the deal with asteroids. Uh, guns do shoot them. I'm not sure how effective they are, how safe they are, but I'm going to give it a shot and we'll see. You know, see how things go. Uh, if I take an asteroid hit, it gets through the guns. Maybe I'll turn off the asteroids until I've figured out a better way to defend myself. But supposedly the guns are supposed to do a lot to uh, repel the asteroids. So let's take a look at some of the guns here. You've got this one right here, the Gatling turret. That's the one I see most people using. Um, they also have an in, well interior turret. I guess isn't really wouldn't be used for anything. Um, then you have uh, Gatling guns you put on your ships. I think the only two automatic guns are this Gatling turret, and I think this missile turret is functional now. Although I'm not really sure. But first things first, let's get to work on our solar panels. So drag one of those down here. And what are we gonna need for solar panels? Well. We're gonna need solar cells, computer steel plates, small steel tubes, metal grids, and construction components. The only thing I don't have right there is solar cells. So let's see what we need for solar cells. Uh, solar cells. Now, what did it say? Like 16. So let's just make uh, let's just make 30 for now. And oh, we got plenty of materials for this. Wow. We got a lot of stuff, dude. I didn't I didn't even do a ton of mining, but I haven't done any mining since my last video. Um, another thing that someone said they wanted me to do is they wanted me to start getting to more technical aspects of the game. And the one thing they mentioned that I would really like to do is some kind of door that will open and close, maybe even for a hangar for some ships. But you guys gotta understand, I've only been playing this game for a very small amount of time. When you saw my first video go up, I started playing the game like the day before. So you gotta understand, you gotta look at it uh, as in like, this is going to take me some time to get used to this game. Plus, I'm doing a Let's Play series, so, uh, you know, I'm, I'm doing the more basic stuff before I get into the more, you know, crazy stuff. Also, uh, I've got to take time to go learn the those crazy things, you know, the, the different things you can do. And, uh, you know, that takes a lot of time, too. Uh, researching in a, you know, for a Let's Play series takes uh, quite a bit of time. And, uh, you know, I've got to find the time for that. Don't forget, I'm also doing Seven Days to Die. And if I, if I slack off on Seven Days to Die, my subs are going to, like, riot, like... <laughs> They'll, get, they'll be pissed, so uh, give me time. I will get into those more um, advanced things eventually. Uh, just, you know, bear with me. I'm not playing creative here. I'm playing, like, hardcore, so... Well, not really hardcore, but... More hardcore than creative. Okay, so we got our solar solar panels here. And uh, let's go out and see if we can put down some solar panels. So, I love this thing. I also love, like, when you walk out, you close the door behind you. You know what I mean? Now, there's absolutely no reason to do that, but uh, I don't know. I just like doing it. I think it's cool. It's part of the coolness of having doors. Otherwise, you might as well just have open open walls. I would kind of wish they'd add, they'd add some kind of airlock situation in this game where you could take your suit off. That would be ideal. But, you know, maybe in the future. The game's still in alpha. All right. So, we need a place for these these things uh and okay so what i need is i need a place for me to land my ships a lot of people have been lamenting that uh i need a, a lot of people have been uh saying that cage you need a place to land your ships now here's the thing if you look at my ships uh some of them don't have landing gear some do but even that landing gear like i don't even see how that's supposed to land because those thrusters are going to get in the way and this drill ship i can't put landing gear on it because every time i put landing gear on it it, it it breaks the landing gear off because this drill ship goes right through asteroids. So the bottom line is I can't land the ships directly on a platform. Just can't do it. But what I can do is I can have kind of a docking station. So what I think is starting right here. Yeah, this would be a good spot for it. Right here, I'll have a big long platform going all the way out into space. 
and then it'll just be a docking station. And then when I make ships, I'll put the landing gear on the side of my ships. And my ship could come down here, you know, landing gear on the side of the ship. It could come down here and just latch onto the docking station using the landing gear on the side. Eh, it's something to think about. That's my plan. We'll see how that goes. Um, so with that in mind, I do need solar panels. Uh, I'm not sure I want to put these. I've never done anything with solar panels. They don't really sit right in my mind. Let's uh, let's see if I can toy around with this a little bit. See, that looks kind of stupid. Oh, that looks better. But is that facing the wrong way? It's a solar panel. It shouldn't matter. Um, one other thing I wanted to uh, let you guys know. I built specifically in this spot so I could use solar panels with the sun being right there. But what I've been told is that when you do turn on asteroids, they come from the sun. Now, I don't know how true that is. It doesn't make much sense. I don't like it from a gameplay standpoint. So, like, if I if I had asteroids on, I could just build on that side of that asteroid. And no, none of the, uh, none of the hostile, you know, meteors could hit me. That seems kind of stupid. So, I'm hoping that's not true. But someone told me it. Nobody, nobody, like, said that wasn't true. So, I'm thinking it probably is true. Uh, let's get this out of the way first thing. Okay, move this out of the way. See, what I would do is, I would have a landing gear on that left drill. Alright, sticking sideways. And then I would just go down like this. Like this. Whoops. And... I would dock. And the landing gear... Would be right there. And then I'd hit P, latch on. And then I'd get out of my ship, and that would be me docking. I think that's the only way it's really going to work for me because uh, I, I don't like landing gear on the bottom of my ship until they have retractable landing gear, which, God, that would be awesome. But anyway, stay on stay on focus, Cage. Uh, so six. Now, will this work like that? I can't put it down. Why can't I put it down? Oh, because I don't have control. That, if that can lay there like that and it'll, it'll work properly, that's what I'm going to do. So hopefully that'll work. Uh, anything I do now at this point... As of this video, I mean, things change. But as of right now, I'm completely in the blind. I, I've never worked with solar panels. I've never worked with guns. Um, I've never worked... I've never played a game with asteroids. <laughs> I mean, I did. Actually, I did it on stream the other day, but it wasn't like... I wasn't really playing it. I was just kind of testing. All right, so let's go ahead and take some of these. Not all of them. How about... 200. I think, uh, what else did I need for those solar panels? Ooh. Large ship or station. I need 64 solar cells. Alright, well, computer steel plate large and metal. Computer steel plate large and metal. Alright, computer steel plate large and metal. Computer steel plate large steel tubes and metal grids I right, can't fit anything else um, let's move a hundred of these over uh, let's produce some more of these eh, let's just do a hundred of them screw it and I don't think we're gonna have enough room in there I think I can place down what I have now so let's go do that So, six, six, there we go. Uh, maybe I want to turn it around. That works. All right, what do we need? We need solar cells and metal grids. Let's go get those. Now, one of these solar panels does not get a ton of power to your base, but if I put a few up there, it, I would really like to have this base almost entirely on solar panels. Because every five uranium lasting for three hours, that ain't going to cut it. Uh, metal grids. Let's put some of these back. No, not that. Metal grids, man. There we go. 
All right. Kind of wish my doors would close behind me. That'd be cool. Also, I want to make a stairway up here. I might do that actually on this video. We'll see. See, I want to make like a little stairway going up. Oh my god, this is going to take forever. Yeah, uh, I want to make a stairway going up to this part so I don't have to turn on my jetpack. Uh, I need to make a landing spot for all my um, all my ships. They're going to dock from the side. Uh, I need to put Gatling guns on here. Actually, maybe I shouldn't put this here. Because if I want to put Gatling guns... You know what? I could put Gatling guns on the sides. Like here. Like here or here. But I am going to want some on the top too. Hmm... Um, that might not be in a great spot. Uh, see, I'm trying to plan where I want to put my Gatling guns. Uh, you know what? It's probably okay here, but I'm gonna I'm gonna put it somewhere else just to just to make sure. I wanna. Oh god. Well, I'm not gonna be able to hold everything, but it doesn't matter because it'll just drop all over the floor. We really need a lot of stuff for a solar panel. Okay, hey, well, six. So that's not gonna allow me to place one there, but it's okay. Uh, I'm gonna place it right here. Yeah, I want the outside level to be only for like weapons. Yeah, that'll work. There we go. Now I can pick this up. All right, let's craft this thing up. Oh my God, that took forever. Sheesh. Alright, but there we go. It's getting three green bars. Now, I don't know what you have to do to get it four green bars, but I've never seen anyone get it four green bars. I think I saw maybe one person doing it. I'm not sure if... Maybe if it's because the other side is against the... Is against the roof. I'm not sure, but uh, I kind of like them up here, so I don't know if I'd want to change that. Uh, maybe I'll maybe I'll toy around with them at some point. But let's see what it's doing for our space station before we... Before we look at anything else. By the way, if anyone knows, are you not supposed to put those flat against item like uh, the roof? Are they supposed to be like you're supposed to be able to see both sides? Is that why I'm only getting three green bars? Because I don't know. All right, now before I put that thing in, I did have three hours worth of power. Let's see how much I have now. All right, four hours, but that might be because uh, some of the machine things aren't working. So let's uh, let's take out the uranium, shut everything down. No gravity. Wow, we can't. We don't even have enough in here to. We don't even have enough uh, power in here to run the gravity generator. Well, let's take a look at what's what's working. Um, speed, power, power usage overload, reactors, thrusters. Um, am I not? Do I, is anything not working? Hmm. I don't think anything in here is working. Oh, current in input. Wait, no, I'm not. I'm not quite sure what these things mean. I'm not quite sure why nothing's working. Cause I do have a thing up there. Something should be working. Hmm. Actually, it does sound like something's working. Maybe. Yeah, I think something's working. Let's take a look. We have one refinery going. And it's not doing anything. Huh. Now that solar panel should definitely be giving me some power of some kind. Uh, I'm not quite sure what's going on. Let's go let's go up top and see what's going on up there. Not that I, I think anything's gonna be going on outside, but Okay. <laughs> Alpha, what are you going to do, right? Um, ooh, where am I? Oh, I'm in another yellow ship. Damn it. Well, you know what? I had, a, I had some stuff in my inventory, and uh, this yellow ship is going to make up for the stuff I lost. Uh, thank God I have a beacon. Let's, um, let's find our beacon. All I see is private sail. I don't see my... I don't see the space station anywhere. Oh, my God. Oh my god, the power is off. I think that's my asteroid, though. Yep, that's my place. 
Oh my god, guys. I shut the power off and then died. The freaking beacon is not doing anything. Ugh. I'm pretty sure my house is on one of those two asteroids, though, so... Um, I think we'll be okay. Speed, why is my speed so slow? Come on, man. Move your ass. Speed's really slow here. It's gonna take me forever to get back to my base, so uh, I'm gonna pause this here and I'll just let you know when I'm back. Okay, I'm almost there. Um, does anybody know, can anyone tell me why I keep spawning in these yellow ships? I kind of want to stop spawning in the yellow ships. Um, now, when I just died just now, that wasn't my fault. I lost some, I lost some items. I think I had some items in my inventory. So I'm going to claim this ship as restitution for me losing those items. I shouldn't have lost because I shouldn't have died because that wasn't, that wasn't anything that was my fault. So I'm going to claim this ship as restitution for the items I lost, but... With that being said, how do I stop spawning in ye these yellow ships? Because I'm getting kind of tired of them, uh, to be honest. By the way, this is my uh, my place, but I'm going to stop this ship right here. I'll go a little closer, why not? Oh boy. I am not slowing down. Hello, dampeners. Let's turn this thing around. The thrusters that make you go forward are always more powerful. That's why it's it's hard to sh slow down sometimes. Got to make sure you put a good amount of uh, retro thrusters on there, the ones that are you know point forward to slow you down. This ship handles like crap now. It's, this ship used to be a lot better. I'm just gonna leave it here and turn it off. The hell with it. I don't want to deal with it right now. I'll I'll move it out of the way some other point, but this is. Boring. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's turn it off. Okay. Let's get back to base. Oh, God, we can't get out of here. Uh, I'm getting out of here one way or another. Let me out! I don't want to turn the damn thing back on. There we go. Turn our dampeners off. Okay, so you could see my, uh... You could see my, um... Solar panel there. It's pretty nice. It's a good spot. Honestly. Oh, cage. Well, why, why is my speed still going up? Oh, there we go. Okay. Because I was holding forward while panicking. Okay. Anyway, um... Yeah, it's, it's crazy. Your beacon will not go on. So I don't think anything in here is being powered. I don't understand if I did something wrong. Um, I, I don't know what I did here. Like I said, I've never worked at solar panels before. So um, I don't know. I don't know. I've never seen anyone put them flat down like that, though. Maybe it's not supposed to be flat. Maybe it's supposed to be... Maybe this part of the solar panel has got to be touching your area. Let me, let me try that. I'll put one down like that. Let's uh, do this. 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 Yeah. Like that. Alright, we need construction components. Yeah, um, I know you guys are probably... Oops, I forgot I don't have any power in here. I know you guys are probably all, like, writing me, uh, what I'm doing wrong and stuff, and I appreciate it. By all means, do it, uh, because I don't know what the hell I'm doing wrong here. It's always hard to get through doors with your jetpack on. Hope they fix that relatively soon. That's kind of what killed me last time. Like, right here. Lost a lot of stuff, but that's okay. I'm gonna get more, I'm gonna get it all back when I take apart that yellow ship. Now, if I died and it was my fault, then I would just not, t I wouldn't take the yellow ship, but, man, that was, that wasn't my fault. And I lost uranium because of that. That's some BS right there. Uh, let's see. We need some uranium here. It's, it's really annoying trying to move around here when you're, got no power. At least you could still use your containers and stuff. Imagine if they were, like, locked. When you didn't have power? Oh, boy. Alright, let's just get some power. Stop playing games here. Thank you very much. The lights are back on. We got power. Okay. 
All right, so we need construction components. We need a stack of these. All right, let's just take this up there for now. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know what I was doing wrong here, but uh, we're gonna we're gonna play around with this. I'm gonna figure some stuff out. We'll see what we can figure out. Oops, like that. Like that. Yeah, that's the way I want it. Yeah, whatever. It's a good enough place for it. All right. So now we need computers, large and metal. Computers, large and metal. Computers, large steel tubes and metal uh, grates or whatever they're called. Oh, I lost all my computers. That... Oh! That makes me mad. I had a couple hundred computers, too. I'll definitely be taking all that yellow shit, man. I'm claiming that shit. That's BS. Uh, large steel tubes. I don't think I need a lot of those. And metal grids. Yeah, let's just put this stuff in there for now. Actually, you know what? Those computers make are made pretty quick. Yeah. There we go. And let's, uh, that would be a good spot. Eh. Nah, we'll do that later. I want to, I want to get this thing figured out before the end of this video. All right, there's no way I'm making you guys sit through this. I'll be right back. Okay, I've installed the second solar panel. And as you can see right here on the right hand side, uh, we are now getting power. And, um, I'll show you exactly what I did. But let's, uh... Let's give, let's give this place proper power again. Still not enough to power the power generator, though. But we could put multiple we could put multiple ones up there. Okay, so I'll show you what I did. Alright, come on up here. So I, you, you put it like that way. Um, it was just as I thought. Uh, this side right here, this is where the power comes out of. And this has to be connected. I'm thinking if I just do this. That should connect it. I don't have plates. Uh, yeah, let's try that. Now this one is only getting two green bars. So uh, I think if I just do that, actually, that should be able to connect all of them. Although I won't be able to put it next to the beacon, I don't think. Let me see. Let me uh, work with this a little bit. See what I can figure out. First of all, let's go get some more steel plates. I want these to look good, though, too. So I don't know if that's where I'm actually going to keep them. But I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Now that one should now be hooked in. I'm assuming. Uh, maybe we'll put another one there just to make sure. Okay. Now those two should be hooked in. This uh, second one should be hooked into the system. Let's go uh, Let's go turn everything off and see how much, see what kind of power we got. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I wish I could, like, make certain uh, machinery in this thing uh, priority. You know what I mean? Like, um, the gravity generator and stuff like that should be priority. And then if there's power left over, it gets routed into the refinery and stuff like that. That would be nice if I could do that. But I don't think you could do that at the moment. So, so we will take turn our jetpack on. Turn Take this out. And you can hear right there. You hear that? That's the refineries kind of going on and off. So, when I first heard that, it freaked me out. Alright, so there you go. Um, hmm. I'm going to do some research into this. Uh, these uh, I'm finding these solar panels very, very interesting. And I'm going to have more answers for you next time I play. But, you know, we got them going. Uh, we kind of know what we're doing. And uh, we'll learn more as time goes along. So anyway, that's going to be it for episode 17. We'll see you next time for episode 18. Till then, take it easy.